I don't think I kept this. Did not. Okay. I don't think I kept this either. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. Bobble's Cry. Needle Saga. Um. So, uh, I was not happy about this because I figured this meant that they were on Tron, but then I saw the wastes. So they are on Tron, but it's uh, like an Eldrazi Tron. So what I'm really looking for here is uh, uh, discard spells. Play the bridge now, because um, I don't want to have it uh, thought not seared out of my hand. Uh, make a construct just in case. Uh, the reason I mill map is because I don't want. I'm afraid that. They might have a uh, blast zone in the deck. <coughs> um. yeah. uh, I think them using the bobble there to get Ugin was a bad play because uh, that let me just duress it instead of mill it. And even then Ugin's not going to be great against me anyways because the Profane Tutor will let me get the removal. Uh, the big thing I have to worry about is the Walking Ballista in hand and the Endbringer in play. Um, so really I need uh, the Profane Tutor to get me a Needle <clears throat> and then I need to try to get another needle or a trophy. Um, they have to play Ballista here or else what thought sees it. trying to draw into something. Uh, yeah. So I, I copy the Shredder. I'm not trying to mill them yet, but they react and try to mill and or draw in response and then I can mill it. So I think opponent didn't play well there either. I, I'm not going to draw the trophy there because of the Profane Tutor. Um, I decided to get the Needle instead of the trophy, um, because I need to shut this guy off first. And then Urza Saga is going to help me live through Inbringer by getting me the second uh, needle if I need it. And they're smart putting it down to one and not killing it, because if they kill it, then I'd be able to just needle in bringer instead. So at least they played that well. Oh, I have both, uh, both of my needles are already out, I'm sorry, I, I put a needle on Karn, blind, I totally missed that. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get Cookbook with this Saga, uh, and Cookbook is going to make it so the Endbringer doesn't matter. Uh, 
Uh, and that's also why I'm holding this marsh instead of playing it, so I can discard it to cookbook when I get cookbook to start gaining life immediately. <coughs> Yeah, I'm milling myself to try to get better stuff. I'd like a trophy, really. Yeah. And I kind of expected my opponent would see the writing on the wall now, but they want to play it through, so... So I don't use the last shredder here because I'm pretty sure, wait, no, I, I guess I did, oh, no, it's not yet, I'm sorry, it's later on in the game. Um, so I'm milling the spheres because of uh, their mana abilities, and if they draw a sphere, I'm pretty much screwed, they're going to draw whatever they want. This is where it gets pretty close. I think here is where I'm thinking. Yeah. yeah. So suspend the tutor and basically <coughs> I know uh, they have two ways of instant speed draw now. They have the Endbringer, and they can kill their Reshaper to draw a card. So I need that Tutor to come off Suspend, so I can kill the Endbringer to get around all of that. I think, really, let's see, if I mill, they draw, I mill, they kill, I mill, I think it was probably better to mill at the end of their turn. I think I made a mistake there. Because it's going to have to happen anyways. Do it to try to draw it. I'm gonna mill. So mill. They're gonna draw their smasher. Mill another smasher. They draw a temple. I mill it mine. And so here they make a mistake. They should use that removal spell on Dree Shaper to get the sphere, um, but they do not. So I get a trophy to kill this Endbringer. And I want to force them to do it now, if at all possible. Because uh, I really want to mill this fear. Yeah. So the Thought Knot is fine. Uh, I will mill this. That's going to shuffle their whole library back. But I'm pretty confident that I'm okay now. Yeah, so there is an Ugin, but I have another Profane Tutor on Suspend, so I'm okay with them drawing an Ugin. I'll survive.
that's just playing out their hand. They show me all the cool cards they got. Yeah, now I'm milling myself to get a stronger lock. Um, no, I'm not going to draw the, the shredder, of course, but I'm trying to get all the dead cards out of my deck. I think they're thinking that I can't mill them out, and that's why they're still playing. I, I want them to draw that temple, so I'm not casting the trophy yet. I'm going to wait until their draw is faced. I'm going to let them have that dead draw. Hmm. All this dust. Yeah. Uh, I do elect to draw the trophy just as a extra safekeeping. Milling myself to get to a stronger lock. <laughs> oh, because my opponent has played all these lands. They do have a lot of really good top decks left in their deck. Uh, I want to draw this card as, as an extra mill rock, so I pop the bobble now. dead. So that's going to be seven mill rocks. They have to have eight good cards in a row. Wait, no, uh, seven, uh, 14, uh, 15 good cards in a row to break the lock. starting to struggle now. <laughs> on top just in case. I'm just, I know I've got all the time in the world. They have less time than me. So uh, we go to game two. They finally concede. Um, because I saw the Inbringers and the Walking Ballistas, I decided to bring in the Cursed Totems. Pretty sure I also bring in damping sphere, but I don't remember if I draw it. Mm, nah. Yeah. 
something like that. And I can make blockers here. Uh, I just got to get a bridge quick. first <clears throat> yeah. and I know I can probably mill to a bridge before this thing will kill me and I've got cursed to him anyways I wasn't too worried about the uh, Ugin because Saga will get me a needle. I do need to get a bridge quick though. Uh, fortunately, I do have blockers here. And I figure they sided out their removal. Uh, I get the needle for Ugin. And I totally blanked that they didn't play a fourth land, so they can't even cast Ugin. So I have Ugin and two unknowns. Uh, I decided to draw, block the guy with Trample first. Uh, still looking for a bridge, uh, but I should be able to stay alive thanks to the cookbook. There's really no way they can win from here. Um, yeah, especially with the bridge on top. So they concede. <laughs> 